Hey guys, Leah Noel Zenko here. I am gonna show you how to do a scuff sand today. So a lot of times you'll hear me say when you prep your furniture to clean it well and then do a scuff sand. So I have cleaned this piece with TSP. I cleaned it really well and then I rinsed it with just clear water and let it dry overnight. Now I'm going to scuff sand it. And if you can see this piece, it's kind of got a, it's, it's, it's not as shiny um, as pieces like this sometimes are, but it definitely needs a scuff sand for the paint to adhere. So all I'm really gonna do is sand the shine off it and just smooth it out. So this is a coarse grit sandpaper medium, which is pretty coarse for surf prep. And I'm just gonna go over the top and I'm gonna do a scuff sand on the top so that you can see. So I wanna go with the, I wanna go with the uh, wood grain, but I'm gonna be painting this, so it really doesn't matter. And I'm just gonna go ahead, get the back here. And I'm applying medium pressure. And you can see it's starting to turn white. I don't really want to break the finish, okay? I don't want to get to bare wood. Some spots I'll have bare wood just because of the wear and tear of the piece. But that's not my goal. My goal is just to take the shine down so that the paint sticks better. So if you're using a primer, I still recommend you do this. Um, if you're just using regular chalk paint, I highly recommend that you do this. Don't skip this step. And that's it. And then when I'm done, I'm just going to take clear water. I won't need much. And then I'm going to wipe it clean. And at this point, I'm ready for primer. Okay, once I get the dust off it, I'm ready to go in with my primer, and that is how you scuff sand. So clean first, scuff sand second.